All right, so we are here uh, with Amichai Luri here at the Kosher Food and Wine Experience 2022. I'm so happy you're here because last year I just had to talk about you behind your back on camera because we didn't do it in person, but this year, here we are, we have you here. So welcome. Thank you. I hope it's you're well time. rested. Well rested yes, from the yeah. flight from Israel. Excellent. Yeah. So uh, I challenged Ami to bring the one wine he's most excited about. And true to form, this man doesn't do anything uh, uh, half. It's always extra. There's two wines here. There's so two wines. Yeah. I, I feel like you brought one that you're most excited about and one that I'm most excited about. So well, well read. But so tell me, tell me of the two wines, what's the one that excites you the most? And tell me why. Well, I'm very proud of the exclusive edition Mosaic. Um, yes, this wine, very proud. Um, this wine just got a 95 from Psalm Journal. Fantastic, congratulations. And they have a nice highlight about it. And the same wine got a 95 from Decanter Magazine. But what I'm very proud of is that once a year, Decanter picks 20 wines out of 20,000 wines, the best wine that every wine lover must discover. Mm -hmm. And they highlighted the exclusive edition mosaic. So finally, we're getting to the general market and getting great exposure, and I'm very proud of that. It's amazing. I, I, Decanter loves you, I mean, with good reason, right? And you know, Jancis and her team, they are, they are the top of the top. Like when it comes to international authorities on wine, there's nobody that, that it's gets a very it very like tough, that. very tough competition. There sure, too. sure is. Right. You must get tired of counting 90 point scores. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I know you can count from 94 to 100 because you're always in that range, so uh, that, that's got to be exciting. Um, all right, so the exclusive edition. Tell us about the, uh, what's the blend because it's something special. So the blend is a Syrah, Cabernet, Petit Verdot, Malbec sometimes. Every year it's a little bit different. Um, I give myself the ability to do whatever I want with that wine. Amazing. And every time I'll do something else and... Uh, it's fun. It's, I'm, it's the only wine that I'm not consistent in. You know, I want to do something different. I do whatever I want to do. And I don't do it every year, too. So It's like every every edition is like a new Every a new piece edition of art. is something, exactly. Amazing. So, you know, you might be thinking, okay, it's Bordeaux varieties, but then there's Syrah, so that's not very accurate. But in right. fact, as, you know, in... It's, it's probably the more accurate expression of a Bordeaux var uh, varietal blend because hundreds of years ago, they used to fortify Bordeaux with Hermitage, which is Syrah from the okay. Rhone Valley. So Syrah and Bordeaux grapes, they play well together. Why Mosaic? Tell me the significance of that. Uh, mosaic is a lot of little pieces of stone, right? Mm -hmm. and, uh, first of all, this uh, mosaics, well, a lot of mosaics were found in ancient Shiloh around in the archaeology digs. Mm -hmm. But because of mosaic, uh, when you're making it, there's a lot, a lot of little pieces of stone and you don't really see what there is. You have to take a step back and then you see, wow, it looks so nice. So also because this is a blend of a lot of different uh, varietals, but it's not just that. It's, um, it's picking the barrels of Syrah, picking the barrels of Cabernet, picking the ba barrels of Petit Verdot, and then the sum is so much larger than the all these little parts, and uh, we thought it's a good name for something, for that kind of challenge. I love it, It's uh, it, that, that resonates on many levels. 